Did you know in Spider-Man? There's a bus that drives by when Uncle Ben drops Peter off at the library. On the side of the bus, a promotional advertisement for the producer's stage musical is seen. Mel Brooks ended up suing Sony Pictures for unwanted advertisement in motion picture space. Did you know in Avengers Endgame? Tony wasn't going to say anything originally when he snapped his fingers at Thanos. The infamous line, I am Iron Man, was added in additional reshoots that happened three months before the release. Robert was hesitant on reshooting the scene, since it would be difficult for him to get back in the proper emotional state for it. But his friend Joel Silver convinced him over a dinner meeting. Did you know that in Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, when Ego shown driving with Peter's mom, his cars painted a metallic teal and orange, which are the same colors of Peter's ship, the Milano. Did you know that in Gravity, this 2013 sci-fi movie had a budget of $100 million, which was much more than an actual Mars Orbiter mission. A real Indian Mars Orbiter mission took only $74 million to complete. It was also launched a year later and has been orbiting the planet to this day. On the other hand, the studio behind the movie did get its money's worth when the film charted at the box office with over $732 million and was the most Oscar-awarded film behind Slumdog Millionaire, with a mind-blowing seven Academy Award wins in one night. Did you know an Ant-Man? Another actor was originally cast as Paxton. Patrick Wilson was originally cast in the role, but when the film was delayed, he ran into trouble with scheduling conflicts. Bobby Cannavale was ultimately cast in the role. And Patrick Wilson went on to voice the president in DC's Batman vs. Superman, Dawn of Justice, and co-starred in Aquaman. Did you know in Last Night in Soho, Terrence Stamp was 82 years old, and he decided that he could do the first part of the stunt where he gets hit by a car. After watching his stunt double rehearse the scene, he decided that he would do it. When Lindsay is hit by the car's bonnet, that's actually him, and the prop is made of foam. The shots after that are a stunt double. Did you know in The Punisher? They filmed quite a bit on location in Tampa, which ended up being good and bad. It was good because most of Tampa isn't residential, so it usually empties out by the time they were filming at night. It was bad because of the fact that Tampa is so prone to thunderstorms. The summer they filmed there ended up being one of the wettest summers since 1890. Did you know in Saint Maud? She uses a very real but outdated method of atonement that has been seen in other films. After Maud has her one night stand and drinks, she actually puts nails in her shoes to atone for her sins. In real life, this outdated Christian method of atonement is called corporal mortification. We've seen it two times before, though. Once in Da Vinci's Code and also in Stephen King's Carrie. 